I'm in Lubeck. Um, Lubeck is actually the number two on the list of the 25 most um, awesome places to see in Germany. The first one, of course, being Berlin, then Lubeck, then I'm not sure. I have to look it up, but I know it is Lubeck. <laughs> Yeah, so we just had dinner. Um, I had sweet potatoes and salad. It was lovely. A little on the greasy side. I'm not feeling so great after that. But anyway, um, and now we decided to go for a walk around the church. So if you guys go down below and you click on the downloads or within this post, there's all kinds of photos from the pictures that were the place we are, pictures of Lubeck, just the church and the surrounding area. It's a very small space and we've gone for a tiny little walk. But um, Feel free to download them and turn them into your own inspiration, your own paintings, and then post them in the community section so I can see what you guys are doing. I'm admiring um, this lovely painting by Andreas Matern. It was painted in 1963 and it is for 950 euros with the frame 1,125 euros. A beautiful, quick and loose painting of Lübeck. The only reason why I know this is Lübeck is because of those towers. Lübeck has seven towers, so this is just a section of the city, but you can kind of imagine because this town is all about the towers, because there's seven, seven churches, or a bunch of churches actually have two towers, so it equals seven. This is the Holzen Tour. This is the main uh, main gate building to get into the city. These are different uh, buildings that are all from Lübeck, and this one over here is also, this is one of the churches. So that one there is the church right behind us. That church, up there. So if I wanted to show you guys what the seven towers look like, I'd have to drive almost halfway to my house and then turn around because only once you're way out of town and then you can see the rolling hills and the seven towers poking out. But when you're in the city, of course, I can say there's one here and I know there's a few over there and there's a whole bunch back there, but you know, we're in the town. It doesn't really work. Anyway, if you guys are in Germany and you're interested in seeing the second best place to go, check out Lübeck. It's pretty cool. Very little of it was bombed in the Second World War, so it's really, it still has its charm. A lot of these buildings were built, well, I was going to say thousands, not thousands of years, but definitely hundreds of years ago, at least. Um, some of them are 11, 12, 1300 years 